Australia's top end is the last sparsely populated tropical wilderness in the world. In the east, spanning over one million square kilometres, are the 3,000 coral reefs of the Great Barrier Reef and Coral Sea, while to the west lies the remote and inhospitable estuaries of Cape York and the Gulf of Carpentaria. This is where we work and play. Cairns Marine is a third generation family business based in far northern Australia. The salt in their blood goes back to the 1960s, a time before diving and underwater documentaries, but not before public aquaria. Our forebears were passionate educators of the Australian public and among the first to bring the Great Barrier Reef to a wider audience. Over the years, Cairns Oceanarium became a centre for the care and rehabilitation of marine wildlife, and it's from these roots that concern for animal welfare grew to be a central plank of our corporate mission. While there is much we would like to tell you about Cairns Marine, we only have time for a few key points. Among the many challenges facing our community in a time of environmental and economic uncertainty, provenance is perhaps the most pressing. With the majority of marine animal supply coming from a largely unregulated ornamental industry, provenance is a matter of great concern for public aquaria. It is incumbent, therefore, on the greater public aquarium community, including suppliers, to give society confidence in the sustainability of the practices underpinning the public aquarium experience. It is a primary objective of Cairns Marine to establish market and community confidence in specimen supply. The regulatory framework of the Great Barrier Reef World Heritage Area, which guides fishery export approval, ensures that the commercial viability of our fishery is determined by our environmental performance. This robust management framework dictates the basic sustainability of our fishery and confers upon Cairns Marine a key point of differentiation in the marketplace. It is a framework that we value very highly. Through our industry leadership role, we developed the Stewardship Action Plan, which commits Cairns Marine and our industry to a continuously improving framework that we believe will come to define world's best practice. This commitment to transparent, demonstrable sustainability is what differentiates Cairns Marine among suppliers to public aquaria. But it's not the only point of difference. Working with researchers over the last decade, we developed a comprehensive understanding of how to capture, handle and husband a variety of sawfish species. Research conducted in our facility into how sawfish interact with their prey and environment is being used to develop strategies to mitigate accidental capture in commercial fishing nets. Endangered worldwide, we now have a better understanding of how to manage sawfish populations in their last stronghold, the wilds of Northern Australia. Cairns Marine has also worked with acoustic telemetry researchers studying large iconic species on the Great Barrier Reef and Coral Sea here, we facilitate the capture, handling and surgical implantation of transmitters into sharks, humphead napoleon wrasse and potato cod. These animals were then released into the biggest acoustic array ever deployed on Australia's Great Barrier Reef. With more than four decades developing intellectual property in large animal handling and husbandry, and 15 years developing complete control over the chain of custody, we believe we offer the public aquarium sector a superior technical and ethical option when making important stocking decisions. We also believe that the collecting standards we have developed within Australia and the Great Barrier Reef World Heritage Area have application internationally and we are working actively with the Marine Aquarium Council to become the first MAC accredited public aquarium supplier. Sustainability is the heart and soul of our business although we prefer to call it stewardship. A healthy environment is our greatest asset and Cairns Marine is proactive in conserving that asset. We are also passionate about the role that public aquaria play in education of the wider community. The public aquarium ethos is in our blood, which is why we are here today. Thank you for listening. <laughs>